Hello guys, Soft Tony here and in today's tutorial I will be showing you how to create a simple and clean slideshow here in After Effects. This technique is perfect for beginners and you can easily create your presentations, intros or promos. So hit that like and subscribe button and without any further delay, let's get started! Alright, we're here in After Effects and here is the final composition and this is the Media 01, my drone footage, alright, and also we will later on import this Media 02, okay, and for now on let's create transition, go right click to create new solid layer, this is gonna be TR for transition, full HD, 1920 by 1080 also this final composition is full HD, and then hit OK, go here in the effects and presets and type CC threads effect drag and drop onto our transition solid layer, let's make further adjustments for the width and height you can play around, I will do for this slide 01, 100, ok, for overlaps let's lower down to 1, and also we will animate coverage, but before that let's lower down shadowing to 0, and also texture to 0, and for the direction you can play around, I will go maybe 45, ok, and now let's animate coverage. Set up the first keyframe here at 0 seconds, click here on this stopwatch, then go to around 2 seconds, and let's go here to 100, and for this first keyframe go to 0, like so, now hit U to show keyframes, select it, hit F9 on your keyboard, and let's also go here inside the graph editor and draw a curve like this one, ok, and now when we hit 0 we have something like this, and here for the media 01, for the track mats, and if you can find track mat options, just hit here toggle switches and modes and you will find it here, ok, now let's find here alpha mat, and as you can see we have this great looking block transition in our final composition. This was our first part, now select transition media 01, right click, pre-compose, I will rename it to part 01, of course you are free to type whatever you want here, select this second option, hit ok, and now let's hit Ctrl plus D to duplicate this part 01, ok, and now move this part 01, upper one, maybe 5 frames ahead or so, and then go here inside the effects and preset, let's type Triton effect, and just drag and drop on this bottom part 01. And now as you can see we have this cool looking transition, for the midtones select whatever color you want, use eyedropper, hit 0, and this is looking nice. And now let's pre-compose this once again, select it, go right click, pre-compose, and this is gonna be slide 01, ok, and now let's create also slide 02, so this is the way you can easily create your intro or slideshow, go here inside the project window, duplicate this slide 01, and let's also duplicate this part 01 composition, hit ctrl plus D, select this slide 02, move inside this final comp, and move maybe 4 seconds ahead, like so, ok, go now inside the slide 02 composition, select part 01, and grab this part 02 here also inside the project window, hold alt on your keyboard and just drag and drop on top of those part 01 compositions. And now as you can see inside the slide 02 comp we have also part 02, go here inside, select this media 01, grab your media 02 and repeat the process, hold alt and just drag and drop on top of this media 01. And now when we go back inside the final composition, as you can see this is our slide 01 and here is our second transition and second media. In every moment you are free to go inside the boat composition, let's go inside slide 02 and then select bottom part 02, hit F3 on your keyboard and change whatever color you want, you can use also eyedropper to change to different colors, and here go also inside part 02, hit F3 on the transitions, you can play around with width and height, with this threads effect I will go maybe 40, and also when we go here inside the finals, hit 0, this is our first transition, and our second transition is also looking great. Alright guys, this was fast and easy tutorial and also this is the way so you can easily create your slideshow, your intro, your promo and so many more. And also you can add here texts, more effects, whatever you want. And also if you found this video helpful, please hit that like button and hit that subscribe button if you haven't already. And also take a look at my channel for even more great tutorials. And you can also leave me a comment down below in the comment section. And until next time. Stay creative and bye bye.